Deborah Claffey and I'm here at Art Current Gallery in Provincetown on Bradford Street with a show that I've curated called Natura Viva. It's a theme show, it's based on our, with artists who work with botanical images and encaustic. And encaustic is using beeswax and damar resin and pigment to make paint. And the reason all artists like encaustic is because it's so versatile, you can embed images, you can uh, work with translucencies and transparencies and opaqueness. And um, So I picked 10 artists that work with the medium on a botanical theme and put together this show. I was given this chance to curate a show by submitting a proposal to Joanne Matera, who is the founder of the International Encaustic Conference when she established a curatorial mentorship program in which she and Sherry Mittenthal from the Truro Center for the Arts at Castle Hill would work with an artist who hadn't curated a show before, find a venue, put the show up, select the work. The curatorial mentorship program that Joanne established is part of the 7th International Acoustic Conference which takes place this weekend every year here at Provincetown. Um, this year there are over 200 artists from all over the world taking part in demonstrations, workshops, lectures, and I think that uh, Joanne and Sherry and some of the galleries in town have organized about 14 separate exhibitions that feature work with wax. I received 250 submissions from over 40 artists. I selected nine other artists besides myself to put together this show. These works are by Michelle Thrain, and she uses encaustic monotype, which is a printmaking process. And she's taken the pieces that she cut out and stapled them together to make a new piece. This diptych is by Fan Ferno, and she uses a process by where she puts down different layers of color and uses a tool to melt the wax and let the color underneath show through. This is called Prayers for the Earth. These are by an artist from Massachusetts called Kay Hartung, and she uses a process where she puts a layer of shellac over the wax and then sets a fire, and when it the alcohol in the shellac burns off, it leaves these gorgeous pattern edges of resin. And she layers over and under that to make these beautiful works. Banner, who was uh, from the area of Washington, D.C., and she works strictly with encaustic on panel, but you'll notice that she uses a lot of drawing and incising and layers and layers and layers in her work. This is one of my paintings called Cut Crystal and you'll see that it's layers of drawing and wax and drawing and wax um, and to get the contours for the leaf patterns that I love so much. The show will be here until June 16th at Art Current, 53 Bradford Street in Provincetown. The hours, the gallery is open from Thursday through Sunday and we hope to see you here.